I was first initiated in a Persian Sufi Tarita in London during a visit. It came a bit as a surprise that it happened in London. Then on my journey and stopping in Hamburg, I stumbled more or less upon a teacher from the Chistis, in, originally from India and Pakistan, who took me on and I had a very intense uh, relationship with him during my stay and ever after. And I gradually worked my way to Portugal, where I was given, due to some dream and some vision I had, the permission, once I settled in Andalusia, to hold Sufi evenings on Thursdays and Sundays. So I began teaching in a way, and I thought, oh my God, this is really crazy. Why is this happening to me? And I thought, well, I have two teachers, and I arrived. That's all cute and dandy. But life went on. I moved back to Morocco, and in the context there, I made contact with a Naqshbandi teacher who was um, half Afghan, half Arab, a Sunni. The other two teachers are, by the way, one is Shia and the other is a Fiber Shia. So I was exposed to different religious backgrounds also, and also culturally, of course. So I became a student of the Afghan one in Spain, in Andalusia. And uh, all these things didn't clash with each other, they were complementing. They were like three musical notes of a chord when I look back in it. And in the end, I finished off my training with the Chishti teacher, who also sent me to Turkey. And this was not uh, just one trip, but various over a period of time. So I've been to Istanbul and Konya. And there I was initiated into the Jirahi Tarika from an American person who was living at the time in, in Turkey. And during my pilgrimage to Haji Bektash, I was initiated in the Bektashis in a very unorthodox way, I may say. All of this you can read in my book on the path of the fret.